Hello there my fellow guardians, how's it going? This is Mario here, bringing you guys another Destiny video. Today as a bonus video, I thought I'd let you guys know how you'll be able to obtain the Necrochasm Auto Rifle in the Dark Below DLC. So let's get right into things. What is the Necrochasm? Well, this weapon is an exotic auto rifle that is being added into the game for anyone who buys the Dark Below expansion pack. The Necrochasm is specifically good for two main reasons. First, it fires at 900 rounds per minute, which is the highest fire rate in Destiny. If you're good at controlling the recoil you'll be getting from this weapon, this is going to be insane. Secondly is its special upgrade, called Cursebringer. This upgrade makes it so that precision kills with this weapon will cause enemies killed to explode similarly to how Cursed Thralls do, dealing damage to nearby enemies. This upgrade is so awesome and I can't wait to get my hands on this weapon to finally try it out. To begin the process to obtaining this weapon, you'll need to get your hands on Husk of the Piss, a common auto rifle. Yes, that's right, a common auto rifle. Its description reads, Desiccated and nigh inoperable, this hive artifact still manages to send shivers up your spine when fired. Remember, if you get this weapon from a mission, don't dismantle it. You'll need it if you want to get the Necrochasm. Once you have Husk of the Pit, you'll need to upgrade it using certain materials you'll be able to find in the Dark Below DLC. The material that you'll need to upgrade Husk of the Pit with is called an Embalming Orb, which is a legendary material. Its description reads, Stolen from a hive chamber, what this tiny orb represents is unknowable and terrifying. It is used to upgrade weapons of hive origin. You'll be able to buy embalming orbs from Eris, the new vendor being added, for 10 Black Wax Idol. Once you have an embalming orb, you'll be able to upgrade Husk of the Pit into Eidolon Alley, a legendary auto rifle. Its description reads, We thought it was inanimate, but it has grown, changed. Ghost refused to analyse it further, but I secretly believe it has become my friend. So, how do you finally get Necrochasm? Well, you'll need to upgrade this weapon one final time using another new material being added called Crux of Crota, an exotic material. Its description simply reads, Their God is now our power. From its description, I imagine that you'll be able to obtain a Crux of Crota from beating Crota's end, the Dark Below's new raid. Once you obtain a Crux of Crota, you'll finally be able to convert Eidolon Alley into Necrochasm, which is the exotic auto rifle we've talked about that deals arc damage. Of course, there's no knowing whether or not this will be the only way to obtain Necrochasm. It's been rumoured to be the exotic weapon you'll get for completing the new raid on hard mode, similarly to the Vex Mythoclast in the Vault of Glass. There's also the possibility of it being just a random loot drop from a legendary engram or a weekly nightfall strike, but at the moment we just don't know. So that just about does it for this video. Hopefully this video has helped you to obtain Necrochasm when the Dark Below launches on December 9th. If it does, remember to smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe for daily gaming content. Remember to follow me on Facebook, Twitter and Twitch. Links in the description below. And I'll see you guys in another video. So until then, ciao.